Hello and, and welcome. welcome. In this how to draw video, we'll be drawing the very hungry caterpillar. caterpillar. Well, that's right. So it's one of our favourite stories, written and illustrated by Eric Carl. Um, you read it a lot as well, and I read it when I was little too. So I think it's going to be a lot of fun. Uh, so we hope you follow along and have lots of fun with us. Are you ready to get started? Yes. Okay, let's uh, start drawing. All right. So we need some paper and something to draw with, like a marker or something. And let's start drawing our very hungry caterpillar. Now, I think the first thing we'll do is we'll start with his head. So, his head is a bit of an oval shape, but one side is a little bit flat. So we'll do that. So we'll do a shape like this. Very good. All right, now on top of his head, he's got two like little uh, antennas. And it's just a nice oval shape like that. One there and then another one next to it. Very good. Now next thing we're going to draw is his eyes. And I'm just going to have to borrow your marker because I'll have to use a thin one for the eyes. So his eyes. Circles. Yeah, so it's too big. They're quite close together. Nearly touching. Yeah, and they're quite big. They take up the whole face. And uh, inside of his, he's actually got really big pupils. So yeah, we'll do it like that. So it's two big circles. So they actually look like two big O's. There you go. Yeah. Good job, wonderful. Now let's draw his nose, and he's just got a bit of a nose there. The good thing about the very hungry caterpillar. It doesn't have to be perfect shapes, it's all, it can be a little bit Wobbly. creative. Yeah. All right, so that's his head, uh, and let's draw the body. So Caterpillar, when you think about Caterpillar, is quite long, and when he walks, he kind of bunches up, so he's in a bit of a U shape. So what we're gonna start, and his body is made up of all different little segments, so just little round bits like that. So you do one part, and you just draw another one there as well. You slowly move through the page as a bit of a S shape. So let's do that. All right, nearly there, halfway. All right, so there we go. We can see that's going well, and it's all different shapes. Don't have to be perfectly exactly the same. We can make a nice little bend. And when we get back down to the the end of his uh, body, you can notice that they start to get a little bit smaller in shape. Just like that. And the last one is a circle. There's a circle. That's his, uh, like a tail, I guess. All right. So there's his body. Now, the other thing that he has got that we need to add in is some legs. So he's got some two legs at the back. At the back. So we'll draw that onto there. You can just do that sort of a leg shape. And then he's got a couple of legs in the front, so we draw, we draw four legs uh, in the front there. And that's how he walks. So he walks with his front feet, and he stops, and he pulls his body up, and the the back legs walk up, and then he pushes forward with his front leg. So he's going up and down, up and down. Alrighty, there we go. So we've drawn the very hungry caterpillar. Uh, next part is to colour in. So we finished colouring in our very hungry caterpillar, and I say I had a lot of fun because we uh, used lots and lots of greens. I think we used every single green marker that we had. Uh, we've also added some extra details because the very hungry caterpillar, uh, like real caterpillars, they're a little bit furry sometimes. So he's got some little hairs in there as well. So are you happy with your drawing? Yeah. That is awesome. You did a really great job. Nice and colourful. I like all the different greens that you got in there as well. Well, thanks for watching. I hope you had a lot of fun. Uh, if you liked this video, check out our channel. We've got lots of other drawing videos for you to enjoy. Uh, we'll see you again next time. Bye. Bye.